Hi everyone, I'm Laurin Su and in this video I'm going to talk about all the Simpsons games I could find for Java. The Simpsons Arcade is a beat em up I really recommend you play, it's a nicely made game. Homer has a handful of attacks and he can also pick up weapons ranging from sticks to columns to hammers, also not enemies are the same. Some dash at you, others just punch you or kick you or use boomerangs or other weapons. There is a nice amount of different enemies and the boss battles, well, each one is unique. Each boss does his unique stuff. And in some sections you can even use Bart to your aid. Or Lisa, which act like power-ups. Throughout the levels are medallions with Bart's or Lisa's face and when you interact with them, well, you activate Bart's power-up or Lisa's power-up and they are cool. The level designs are top quality stuff for a Java game, the backgrounds are animated and chock full of details and the remaining aspect to discuss are the controls, which are spot on and responsive. I recommend you play this game. If you are into Java games, then this game is a must play. Don't waste any minute without having played this game, it's awesome. The Simpsons Minutes to Meltdown is an action puzzle game. That will be the best description. And the game, in spite of being short, has incredible production value. The game starts with a cutscene. I know, cutscenes like this are crazy in Java games and not often to be seen. That's one reason why the game has big production value. And then another one are the little details that are so plenty it, it's amazing. See, in the game you have to get Homer back to his job at the nuclear power plant in the time limit to stop the meltdown that leads to, well, the cover of the game. And through the whole playthrough you have a button that brings up a phone telling you how much time you still have till it's too late. But things are never easy. Homer doesn't just run. For example, right from the first level you'll see Homer's thought bubble that tells you what you have to do. First off, you'll have to get to the car, but when you get there, someone stole Homer's keys. And after more stuff that leads to other stuff, you end up chasing a pig. And then after more stuff leading to other stuff, you run around in a city under chaos. And then after more stuff leading to other stuff, you get to the nuclear power plant. And after more stuff that leads to more stuff, you finally save the day. And in the first level, the level of interactive things is amazing. When an OK icon appears, you can interact. The game is awesome, and even if there are games out there of this sort, it still feels like this game is pretty unique. I recommend you play this game. As I said, it's awesome. The Simpsons Itchy and Scratchy Land is another monster Java experience. The game is an action adventure. You get some big spaces to roam and have to solve puzzles and even if the exploring is done with Homer, you will also play some mini game like parts with Bart that slingshots enemies or with Marge that can vacuum, she can draw enemies into traps or she can propel objects to damage enemies and Homer throws his bowling ball to solve stuff. This game is again a masterpiece, just like the other two games. I recommend you play all of the three games. They are amazing. They are masterpieces. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, click the join button and choose one of the perks. You have the link to the join button in the description. Also, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord if you want. And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.